It's me, Vicky Baines, heart failure clinical nurse specialist, and Leslie Sprayson, our heart failure team um, clinical nurse manager. So, a day in the life of the Shine Clinic. Leslie, where does the name come from and what is it for? Shine doesn't actually stand for anything. It was an award that was granted to the hospital when the Heart Failure Clinic was first set up. Um, and it's a name that stuck. It's actually an ambulatory heart failure clinic for reviewing heart failure patients on an outpatient basis. Okay. And who works there? We are staffed by heart failure clinical nurse specialists. We have support from healthcare support workers. We also have access to consultant cardiologists. Okay, and what will happen when I arrive at clinic? When you first arrive at clinic, you will be greeted by a member of staff. We will take some basic observations, possibly some blood tests. You may have a tracing of your heart recorded. You will then be assessed by one of the clinical nurse specialists and a treatment plan devised. So what tests will I have done and why will I have them? So the sort of tests you might have done, you might have blood tests to test for your kidney function. You may have an echocardiogram if you've not had one recently to assess the overall function of your heart and an ECG, which is a electrical tracing of your heart to assess its rate and rhythm. Okay. And what will be discussed in clinic? So we will ask you about um, any pe past medical history, um, your onset of symptoms, what those symptoms were, whether there was anything that precipitated them. We'll be asking you to describe what your normal day's like and we will then base our treatment around those symptoms. We will also, if you've had a new diagnosis of heart failure, we'll also give you some literature to look at and also go through that literature and explain exactly what heart failure is, how it's going to impact you in the future, any future tests or investigations you might need to have and things that you yourself can do to help your overall well-being. Okay, you've already mentioned that I'll be seeing um, a clinical nurse specialist, but is there anybody else that I'll be seeing? Do do I see a doctor or a consultant? You may see a, do may see a consultant if the clinical nurse specialist feels it's necessary at that time, or you may get an appointment to see one later on in a separate appointment. You could also possibly see a member of the cardiac rehab team. So overall it's a nurse-led clinic? Yes. Um, and how often will I need to attend the clinic? It depends on your symptoms. If you're coming to the clinic because you are um, overloaded with fluid, it may be that you have to attend every day. It may be that you <coughs> attend less often but this will be discussed with you at the time related to what your symptoms are and how we're treating you. Okay and if I've been discharged from clinic um, and I feel that my symptoms are getting worse what do I do then? We will have advised you about simple steps you can take if your symptoms worse. You'll be given what we call our traffic light system which will which gives you basic pictorial and written information about what to do if and obviously that suggests that if everything's going along fine then you can carry on if the simple things that that are suggested in the leaflet don't work then you can always phone for advice from one of the specialist nurses thank you leslie